You truly are special, miss. What do you mean, Mr. Pumpkin? Why don't you go ask the princess? I bet she's dying to see you. Quick, the princess is awaiting you. I'm impressed. I wasn't expecting you to get this far. Mr. Pumpkin, where am I? Oh, I don't know, my girl. We could be anywhere. Quick, the princess is awaiting you. It's Fleta. The statue of the almighty Princess Fleta. This statue looks familiar somehow. What happened to these statues? Pumpkin charm. <laughs> what is this? Why is there a statue of me here? The statue of a little girl bowing down in a graceful gesture as if greeting someone. Flutter. <laughs> Welcome back, miss. Flutter, I have to talk to you. Talk about what? I need to know what's going on, and I know you know. How did you get out of the attic? I... Tell me, miss, how did you escape? Flutter, listen to me. Please, just listen. <laughs> yeah, then. Say, hey, miss. Will you play one last game with me? Flutter, please, no more games. I just want to... Ooh. Play my favorite game, shall we? Ooh. If you win, I will tell you everything I know. If you lose... <laughs> you probably already know what will happen. Do you promise that you will tell me what's going on? Why, of course, have I ever lied to you? Let's play now. Sit down on the nearest chair as soon as the music stops as quickly as you can by pressing Z. Be careful not to be left out or you will lose, and you probably know what will happen if you do. Oh. Well, let's see what happens if I lose. You lose. Hooray! Look, I get I won. I won, I won. Flutter. What do you want, loser? Flutter, I... That will be Princess Flutter to you from now on, understood? Flutter, I don't want to... Don't worry, miss, everything will be fine. And it will all be thanks to me, won't it, Egliette? Flutter. Won't you at least tell me what's going on? That's not what we agreed on, is it now, miss? You won't have to worry about a thing. Everything will be up to me from now on. You finally will be able to rest, won't she, Egliette? Wait, Flutter. What are you talking about? No, it's nothing, miss. Now come over here, let us talk. No. Don't be stubborn now, miss. Everything will be fine. All you have to do is trust us. Now come, let us be friends. No, this is wrong. No, I don't want to stay here. Now that's something horrible to say, isn't it, Egliette? Indeed it is. There's nothing you can do to change our promise. Everything will be just as it was supposed to be. 
All you have to do is... Take a rest and leave everything to us. Hey, I'm all you need, miss. Nothing can separate us, not even Mother's dirty lies. Bed ending number one, porcelain. Pumpkins again. All right. Okay, let's do this again, but actually win. Getting faster, I think. Yep, it is. Oh. Okay, then. You win! Uh-oh. I'm sure this will be enough, Letta. Please tell me what's going on. You said you won! I'm the princess, and the princesses declare what happens in their kingdom. As far as I'm concerned, I'm the one who won. Letta, I'm serious. I need you to tell me what's going on here. Stop asking me that. Haven't I told you you're staying here? No, I'm not staying here, Flutta. What was that now? I don't want to stay here. I already told you you're staying. Don't make me lose my temper, miss. But Flutta, I can't. And why can't you? Because I need to go find the answers you refused to give me. I'm... I'm sorry. I didn't mean to yell, but I'm not feeling very well. I need to know who I am to understand why I'm here. I'd like to spend more time with you and Egliette, but... It's not enough. It doesn't feel right to stay here when I don't even know you. What do you mean you don't know me? After all I've done for you. You don't have the right to say that to me. Don't you dare belittle me. My name is Flutter. My name is Flutter. 
You wanted a friend to play with, and I gave you one. You needed a place to play, and I gave you one. How is that not enough for someone like you? Let up, please. I'm not letting you go. You came to me first, and I'm not letting you leave me again. Butta, I'm grateful for having you as a friend, but I have to... <laughs> grateful for having me as a friend? Is that it? How can you be so selfish? I deserve better than this. I waited for you. I made a place for us to be together. I'm not letting my kingdom go to waste. Flutter, I don't understand. That is enough, Flutter. Time we let it go. What are you talking about? Are you telling me to give up? Yes, I am. It's time we end this farce, my girl. Hey, Gliette, what's the meaning of this? Are you on her side now? Is that it? Don't be stubborn, Flutter. You know there's no end to such a path. Hey, Gliette, I'm not a liar. I'm a princess. Why are you doing this to me? I thought you were my friend. I am, and that is the reason why I will stay here with you. With or without our kingdom. Egliette! You're doing this on purpose, aren't you? You want me to lose to her. I want you to stop lying. That's enough, Fleta. Daydreaming will only take you so far. Egliette, shut up! This is enough. Shut up! Why don't you understand? All I wanted was to wait for you. I wanted to play with you again. I don't want to be alone anymore. I want to be with you. Lada. But you won't understand. You said... You said you didn't even know me. Flutter, please forgive me. I didn't mean to. You're going to leave me again. Aren't you? I'm never going to forget about you again, I can promise you that. I want to be your friend, Fleta. I don't know what happened before, but I met you again, didn't I? And we played together, didn't we? I had fun with you. Me too. Don't cry, Flutter. I'm sure we will meet again. Wait. What? Before you go, can you... tuck me into bed and tell me a story? Of course. I'm sorry, Flutter. I don't know any stories. That doesn't matter anymore. You really have to go? I'm sorry, I don't know what I'm looking for, but I need to go find it. I'm going to be all alone again. Egliette will be with you, right? But I wanted to spend more time with you. Miss. I'm happy I got to meet you in the end. I wish we could play for a little while more. Lada. I want to give you this. Hmm. What is Regalia? Rosen Glocken. It's my treasure. Please take good care of it. Are you sure I can keep this? Uh-huh. It's for you. Oh, in that case? Oh. Imitation pocket mirror. I want you to have this after all. You're so silly. Thank you, miss. I promise I will take good care of it, too. Let's play together again sometime. Hmm? Lada? I'm so sorry.
Rabbit hole. This collection of mirror shards rests scattered on the bed sheets, each and every piece devoid of reflections. Okay then. Going down is nothing, going right is nothing. Going up is probably the way, because going left is nothing. Pumpkin! Igliette! Igliette! Thank you for all you've done, miss! Igliette, are these perhaps yours? Ah. Igliette's regalia! No, miss, they belong to you. Consider them a gift from me, if you will. I see. Thank you. Before you go, miss, I have something to tell you. Be aware of what's yet to come, my girl. As I've told you before, everything is in your own hands. Agliette. Although it is a rather selfish request, could I ask you to keep these memories close to your heart? Of course, I will never forget about you and Fleta. I see, you have my gratitude, miss. Go on now, follow your own path. For no one other than you can do so. Thank you, Egliette. And please take care of Fleta for me. I will, miss. There's nothing for you to... worry about. Okay, so you can go back. Pumpkin. Would you like to save your progress? I would if I were you. Sure. Passage. Where am I? The immense white sheet lays beyond the openings of the wall, leaving nothing behind but a fragile rays of ephemeral light. Same thing. Ah, another mirror you go through. Mirror maze. Oh, I got a reflection now. <laughs> uh oh, that's not me. Whoa. Oh! I don't like this place. I don't like it either. Being followed by something. Okay then. Alright, good. Run! 
Whoa, that's trippy. Eep. Whee! Oh, other way, other way, other way. Oh. Okay, that's weird. Try that again. Can't really see when it does that. Trippy as heck. Ooh. Made it. Ooh, miss. Miss, please wake up. Oh. Are you all right, miss? Ooh. Hmm. Who are you? Please be careful. You shouldn't make any harsh movements. Please don't be scared. I'm here to help you. Who are you, miss? Oh, I apologize for not introducing myself. Arpe, maiden of pristine eyes. My name is Arpe. I'm... No, it's fine. I understand you'd still be scared after what happened earlier. But please, believe in me when I say that I'm here to help you. It is alright to trust me, miss. I... What is it? Who was that chasing you down earlier? She's a very ill child. She should not be trusted, miss. I'm afraid her intentions are rather harmful. I see. Please listen, miss. I'm going to protect you from any harm. You'll be safe with me, I can promise you that. Miss Harpe. Oh no, please just call me Harpe. Let's go inside now, my girl. I'm sure you're tired and probably thirsty as well. Let's go have some warm tea, shall we? Yes, thank you. You're still pretty hesitant, aren't you? I'm sorry. I just can't seem to calm myself down. That's all right, miss. I can assure you, you'll be fine. Come now, let's go somewhere more comfortable. Thank you, Miss Harpe. Oh, I mean, Harpe. Please don't force yourself. Let's hurry inside. Yes. Hmm. Please take a seat. Where are you going, miss? Hmm. Ah, there's a safe point right up there. I believe there are some... Choices to make here. Can I see anything? Ah, the mirror surface is dull, as though covered in a thick layer of dust. An aged grandfather clock stands next to the fireplace, both its arms and pendulum hanging still as if frozen in time. Please take a seat. It might be rude to read it with Harpe in the room. There's one here that's written in French. 
Ave por una infante defunte. It is one of my favorite pieces. Oh. What does it mean? Pevene for a dead princess. Pevene is a type of slow, very elegant dance. I see. Various volumes of sheet music are lined up on the bookshelf. Ah, forgot to go around the fire. The flames dance eerily in hurried, spontaneous movements, illuminating their surroundings with a faint yet warm glow. Hunger charm. Oh. Sit. I've been awaiting you for a long time, miss. You have? Yes, I have. Although I do know it might sound strange. I... You've never met before, have we? No, not like this. You may think of me as your guardian angel, miss. I will always be here to protect you. I still have so many questions. I will try my hardest to give you the answers you're looking for. Then I... Hmm... What is my name? I can't seem to remember my own name. I was wondering if you knew what it might be. I'm sorry, miss, but that is a question I don't have the answer to. I see. I'm sure you will remember it soon. I can assure you everything will be alright. Thank you, Harpe. You're so kind. Oh, that's because I care for you, my girl. You have finally smiled. Thanks to you. That is the expression that fits you best, miss. I wish for nothing more than your happiness. And I will do everything in my power to see you smile. Thank you, Harvey. I still have one more thing to ask you about. That's alright with you. Go ahead. Do you know of a girl named Fleta? Fleta? I don't think so, miss. Although it does sound quite familiar. I see. Did anything happen? Oh no. I was just wondering if you had heard of her, that's all. Oh my. Time sure does fly by when you're entertained, doesn't it, miss? Yes, it does. You should drink your tea before it cools. Um, drink it. I will, thank you, Harpe. Oh, I almost forgot. Oh. Uh, is everything alright? There's... What is it? Um... There's something in the tea. What do you mean? There was something inside the teacup. I see. I'm sorry. I, I apologize, miss. Oh no, it's all right, Harpe. I also overreacted. I truly am sorry, my girl. Is there any way I could ever compensate you? There's no need to compensate me, Harpe. I'm all right, and it wasn't that bad. But I... Your tea was delicious. Thank you, miss. Actually, I've prepared something else for you. Oh, Harpe, you didn't have to. Yes, I did have to, miss. Today is a very important day. It must be celebrated. I made this for you, my girl. Oh, Harpe's cardigan. I hope you like it. This is so pretty, Harpe. Is it really for me? Of course. I, I made it myself just for you. Thank you so much, Harpe. You're welcome, miss. It does fit you well, I'm so glad. Very comfortable, too. Thank you so much, Harpe. You can stop thanking me, my girl. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll take good care of it. Thank you, miss. Oh, then. Should you go make more tea? You must be quite thirsty. Oh, no, I'm fine. Oh, no, I insist. I want to compensate you for what happened earlier. 
There's no need to, but all right. Now wait here for a little while. I will be back soon. In the meantime, feel free to read some books. Thank you, Harpe.